Hey guys, welcome back. Before we start this video, happy Thanksgiving. I'm not sure when I will be posting this video. I think we're posting it either tonight or tomorrow. I'm not sure yet. So, just to get it out of the way, happy Thanksgiving, guys. Alright, let's get started. And as you know, when Thanksgiving come around, or around at least around this time, we have the Black Friday. Also, the Cyber Monday. And we also have also the, the Trove. Um, the Cyberwolf Trove, I think, also comes uh, comes with the uh, with the event. All right, so let's get started. As you know, Belltron is back on Black Friday. Let's see. Okay, uh, yeah, yeah, the same way it, it it appears in what in our shops as well as the Cyberwolf Trove. I have not really started on the Cyberwolf Trove. I think I missed it last time. Okay, there's also new and previous items available for our purchase individually. And most of them are available for gold. So if you have like extra gold that you want to kind of like collect the dust in your in your vault. Actually, it's in our bag, the little bag, <laughs> our little backpack. I've never done these several wolf. I might do it this time, but... I am working tomorrow, so hopefully it the actual trove it it has more than like a few days that way I can uh, actually do some of the trove and start putting it in my uh, at least I'll have access to it for the next event or anytime I want it. Okay, while we are doing the adventuring, you also I'll find the cyber knight. Okay, the cyber knight is uh, appearing in our day in our daily. Uh, a daily boss so I am still missing a few pieces of his uh, of his armor set I believe I'm still missing the the shield and the main armor piece the chest piece somehow that I'm having difficulty getting that piece I've been fighting him over and over the lot on the previous year but it was so hard to get okay we got some new stuff on the Black Friday items we have the Onyx Taylor Scout armor set I believe I believe this is it. I'm not sure which one it is, but I do like. Uh, it's it has a similarity with the um, with the uh, the vampire set that we that we get from Darkovia. And you also have the wand, and you got the the mail what a scout and the sword. I think this this might be this the. The the scout one. I'm not really into that. All black. I like this one a little bit better. The bow is somewhat way too dark, but it is Black Friday, so I'm cool. I do like the wings though. And we got the toothpick, and yeah, I'm not really into though. It's some. It's like I do like dark um themed armor pieces, but that one is just way too dark. It's like it completely blends, but I do like the wings. I have a lot of dark um, <coughs> armor set. I mean armor armor pieces that that would really go well with that one. As for the new Cyber Monday items, we have the Melody wait Melodia or Mel Melodia fan armor set. I think this is her, and we also have the keyboard, the electric spike glaive. I think this is this guy right here that he's using. He's and wow we got the cyber dragon wings that that is cool and also the the set i'm pretty sure that will be um all uh dragon crystal so i don't i don't think i'm able to get any of them and as for the seasonal items and activities we have this side of wolf trove so i will be participating in that one hopefully if i if i do find the time because i do like it that is kind of cool though. Uh, I'm not sure why I never participated in it last year. But oh well. I'll try to hopefully try to get some of those pieces and then put it in the trove. Okay. And let's see if anything on there. No, it's pretty much just a regular trove collecting and, and putting it in there. Okay. As I mentioned before, the Cyber Knight will be in. We will be showing up in our daily boss. So. If you have not got all the pieces yet, this is like one of the perfect times of doing it. I'm not sure how long he will be staying. Maybe a week or two. Probably two weeks at most. And 
Also, we have the <coughs> on the daily chest reward. You have a you have a chance on getting the da -da -da -da, the uh, the Legion Techno Knight and the Robo Wolf Trouble Form. So you can also tr um, get some of the items using your treasure shards in the chest shop. So I've seen a few people have these, but I've never known where to actually get them. I always thought they would be like uh. It would be Dragon Crystal because it's a very unique design. Most of the time, those kind of design are only DC uh, purchase. So it's somewhat surprising to me that you can actually get them on a on a daily chest, and you can also purchase them with your treasure shards. So I might try to get. Hopefully, I, I will I will get a few pieces during my uh, my daily collecting on my daily chest, but I'm not counting on it. So I, I don't really pay too much attention to it until I actually get one currently I'm kinda of running out of space again <laughs> and in that note we have this um, the become a lawyer banker member you also get once you do the your um, the, the quest line and I believe the let's see here the bank needs to collect some okay yeah we have a, a actual uh, quest it's a unique quest that you will be collecting um, <laughs> some um, citizens are behind on their investment so your job is actually to help collect you know how you do the like like repo stuff and you'll be getting a free bank in the process and plus a title the repo hero because <laughs> you're becoming a hero a hero by repoing your uh, your fellow citizens of uh, Babylon, <laughs> I'm good. I'll do it. I get a free ba uh, free vault, so I will definitely be doing that. I will be making a video on that uh, on this um, on this uh, particular uh, unique quest. So I look forward to that one. Also, a, we have a 50% discount. Um, well, 50 percent more Dragon Crystal when you purchase from the uh, from the upgrade shop. So if you got extra cash, buy some of that. You get more crystals. I I might purchase, but I'm not sure if I will or not. I've as right now I've spent so much already on my uh, on the Christmas gifts. I, I spent way too much already, so I might hold back until like until until the next uh, next deal because I can't do it right now. I spent so much already. I don't want to go in the red. Okay, that's out of the way. Uh, on the last chance, Dottie and the art counselor of the Camp Gonagacha is preparing to leave Babylon around November 29th. So that gives you about seven days. So if you have not gotten all your stuff that you wanted to do or participate in any of the event in Camp Gonagacha, this will be the time to do it in this week and about three days of next week. Okay, and the vault. And the pet uh, discount ends around the 29th also. And the Black Friday and Summer Monday seasonal shop and activities will leave around December the 20th, 2023. Okay. Uh, the, the Naga Saga is, as you know, we've been getting a lot of delays on it. But it's finally coming in our way. Hopefully there's no, uh, no more... Delays. We've been waiting so long for that final chapter. Hopefully, we get it this time, and there's no more delay on that event because we've been waiting so long now. I understand that they were having some issue, and where some of the players have, they were trying to get as many of the uh, the requests that the players were asking for. So I understand that part. So I'm I decided okay. Hopefully, we get some of the stuff that we asked for. And we have a good uh, final chapter. Hopefully, the story is good. Cause sometimes the story is kind of like eh, it just like you just flow right through the uh, the storyline. You don't really get kind of like you don't get hooked in and want to know what the next uh, the next uh, not not event the next chapter will be. Yeah, I just like I just flow through the entire event and most of the uh, the maps on the last one, the last update, is pretty much empty. There's like hardly anyone there, 
unless you're doing the uh, uh, you are trying to get for the swords because you need several items from the uh, some of those maps, especially when you have like the the contracts and stuff. I'm somewhat still struggling to finish uh, to get the um, the Abaddon's Cruel Sword because the boss is somewhat hard to to determine when he will show up, if he will show up. I'm um, yeah, I'm having to get the uh, the runes for it. I did have it, but I wasn't paying attention, and I used it on something else. I said, "Oh, cr I said, crud! I used all those, and I, I had enough to get the sword." Cause I was uh, I was in the the forge of forlorn, and I, I said oh, I don't have enough. I just I just used up all my runes, and now I can't get uh, the next part, the next upgrade. So I said, Ugh. so I'm struggling on trying to get the first one now. I was told that you can do uh, some players actually do that, and they can post it in some kind of on, on a Discord thing, but I, I haven't done it yet. So I always go there as much as I can. I teleport there and teleport back, especially when my friends are there. Just uh, just waiting for the boss to show up. So I'm still struggling to get just the first sword so I can get the second one. Alright guys, this will be all for this uh, sh this video regarding the Black Friday and Cyber, Mo Cyber Monday. Also the Troves, we also got a new, uh, a new title. That will be, if I'm not mistaken, the Repo Hero, right here. Also, it, you also get an, a free bank, a free bank vault. So if you're looking for a new one like me, another another a vault. Uh, do your uh, do the do the quest line first for the um, for your to get to become a loyal member of the bank. <laughs> I will I will I will do that first. I might try to do a few videos like what all the new stuff is, but this will that will be the first thing to do. Because I want to do a video on it, then upload it as soon as I can. Alright guys, so we will show a video. I, it's a little longer than normal for my uh, for any news and update. But as always, thanks for watching. Later guys, peace. One, two, three.